Back in the early to mid 1980s, I was a preteen and teen. My family briefly attended Maple Ridge Baptist Church. The pastor was the Reverend Dr. Lonstein. But later, when I attended Canadian Baptist Seminary and Trinity Western University, was a theology professor. Although I didn't take any classes with him. I remember the sermons back at the church were very good and intellectual. In fact, I met with him one day, asking him some questions. One memorable was sermon, in hindsight, I now see as a reform view of prayer. Here it is, non-exhaustively paraphrased. He stated something along the lines of, God does some things without anyone praying about it, just because it's within his will. Might be his perfect will, might be his permissible will. God does some other things, might be his perfect will or permissible will, if someone prays about it. And in particular, the prayers of his people who are regenerated Christians. So a key is to pray along the lines of God's will and is to pray that you will be praying along the lines of God's will as it talks about in 1st John a key prayer to use is the Lord's Prayer Matthew 6 being an example 